One of our biggest achievements, one of our, our biggest hits was our first viral. It all started with a music video from Maroon 5, Girls Like You, and it went crazy viral on, on YouTube. And our audience were all asking, how did they make that? You know, we wouldn't see that as well. And we started doing that effect on Monday. I still remember it. We tried to recreate that effect on, on the cheap, like with some DIY stuff. And it was Tuesday. We still haven't figured it out. Wednesday, nope. Thursday, nope. And we were so desperate because we knew that we just had to jump on this trend. It was going to be big. So we filmed the entire prog progress of us failing. And then on Friday, finally, we figured it out. And then we showed the end result. We, make, we made a fun video of that. We showed how we failed first and then how we came up with the solution. And uh, like the music video itself, we also went a little bit viral. That was for us like, that was a huge hit. That was amazing. That feeling of, that, that accomplishment, that was amazing. People telling me that they're, they're, they've come out after 52 years. You know, they changed their life after being married with three children. You know, they changed their whole life. It was something they were so scared of their whole life and they're able to live free and, and themselves. I'm like, that to me, that's my biggest win. I'm like, changing, I'm affecting someone's life like that. Like, it's so crazy. And that's what YouTube did for me and the fact that I can pay it forward, I, that's my biggest win. I just make, I sit here and I talk to a camera and people are getting the courage to be themselves. It's crazy. Probably our favorite video, my favorite video at least, is a music video episode that we did with YC over in New York. Um, that episode was awesome because of how almost unscripted it was a lot of times. There's this awesome story about us trying to make a music video and our artist not showing up and finding an artist online last minute. Uh, anything that feels real and genuine, anytime you can kind of scratch that surface a little bit on YouTube, that's when you know you've really kind of hit gold and you feel good about the content. It feels personal, it feels genuine.